Hey everyone, I'm Dan Spada, and in today's video, I'm going to show you the new Google Forms update that automatically saves your progress as you're working. Google recently announced that there's a new update that will automatically save your responses in Google Forms as you're working. This is amazing news for anybody who's ever filled out a Google form and then either tried to change devices or lost internet and had to start all over again. It's a particularly useful feature for teachers who give long assessments. So if something does happen, the student doesn't lose all of their work because now Google Forms will save the draft so that if something does happen, the student can just go back in and pick up where they left off. This feature is currently still in beta and is only available to Google Workspace for Education customers. I have, however, put a link in the description below to a form that admins can fill out if they are interested in participating in the beta. Once this feature does begin rolling out, there's nothing that admins will have to do. You'll just notice that either your responses or your students' responses will be automatically saved on the Google Forms. And this feature will be available to Google Workspace for Education Fundamentals, Education Plus, Education Standard, and Teaching and Learning Upgrade customers. It will not be available to Google Workspace Essentials, Business Starter, Business Standard, Business Plus, Enterprise Essentials, Enterprise Standard, and Enterprise Plus. And it will also not be available to the G Suite Basic, Business, Frontline, and Nonprofit customers. So this update actually reminds me of the early days of Google Docs, when people were very excited that Google saved your work every time you made a change, because that meant they would never have to experience having all of their work lost and having to start over. And now with Google Forms, uh, you will never have to start a test or a form all over again. Um, so this should be rolling out very soon. If you have already started using this, please let me know in the comment section below how much you love it and how much it has changed your life. Um, and for more Google tutorials, please check out the description below where you'll find lots of other walkthroughs, tutorials, and reviews. Um, and if you know of any teachers that will be very excited by this news, please feel free to share this video with them. And if you haven't already, please take a second and subscribe to the EdTech Show and click on that notification bell so that you get notified every time there's a new video. And if you haven't followed me yet on Twitter, please take a second and follow me at Dan Spada and on Facebook at facebook.com slash the EdTech Show. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.